Visitors to the 2015 Pan Am Games in Toronto will have the opportunity to view art designed and created by a group of local young artists. Sharon Hunter has been the facilitator of this project. Sharon, July seems a long way off, but these murals are actually ready to go to Toronto now. Can you describe where they go from here? Um, well, basically, they're going to be um, taken down to the Toronto subways and they're going to be <coughs> put uh, behind uh, cases in different uh, subway locations. And it's, ba it's to greet the uh, Pan Am and Parapan um, athletes that are coming to Toronto and also to highlight the... Um, I guess uh, different youth artists around Ontario, so not just in Toronto. So this is the first time the AFCY Arts for Children and Youth have reached out beyond uh, Toronto to work with uh, other groups um, in Ontario. So give a, a, a wider scope of um, vision and ideas and creativity um, what represents Ontario, which a big part of it is the North. Sharon, as an artist, why did you decide to partner with the Urban Aboriginal School here and the art program that they offer? Uh, I felt that it was really important to highlight the artists and youth at the school. It's a small school. Um, I think that uh, it's uh, underrepresented in, in a lot of ways in the Sioux. Can you describe the murals to us? What were the, uh, the uh, themes that you were given to use? Um, there's 41 panels for the Welcome 41 Spirit panels and uh, we were given two um, themes to work with which was inspiration and uh, local narratives. So the groups here at the school in the art, um, um, in the art uh, program, they decided which ones they wanted to work with. Jacob Carter is one of the artists involved in this project. Jacob, can you describe the mural behind us? What was your inspiration and how did you design it? Uh, the inspiration was actually to show that Roberto Mata was from here in Sault Ste. Marie and to show the people a good vision of Sault Ste. Marie and the ideals of what Sault Ste. Marie is and where like different people have come from and the great things that actually have come out of Sault Ste. Marie. Describe some of the images on the mural to us. Uh, the images were of the Canada arm because it's a good showing of Canada and the way we are slowly getting out into space and being able to help the rest of the world as well. Um, the shuttle is to show Roberta Bondar's descent out into the, the into space, as well as this small area that we have that is circled on the on the painting is to signify Sault Ste. Marie solely in the painting. Shauna is one of the youth artists involved in this project. Shauna, can you talk about the circle that you were involved in? I zoomed in on my camera. It was uh, more like blobs of color. I just went and. I don't know, I just rolled with it. I don't know, I just put where color I saw color in. There, I, I didn't really find it that hard. It was easy, we already knew what we were gonna do and that was it. How did your group come together to create this design? What was the process? Uh, first we actually all sat around the table, we just drew out on a piece of paper, we got a bunch of pictures together from the internet and just kind of figured out what we wanted to do, where we wanted to place it and then we started on the nice large background and put the earth in there and made sure that that was the most subtle area technically. Can you describe the medium that you used and also how you brought the color and light into it, especially in the space, the kind of aurora borealis that you have going? Uh, a lot of water, a lot of pink and purple and so on and so forth. It was um, just paint. Uh, we were just using acrylic paints and that's it. That's all. No, no anything else. Acrylic paint and water. What's your favorite part of the mural? The earth. It's it's actually the, the tapping of the earth. It was literally just punching it with a paintbrush the whole time, so it actually turned out really cool. And why do you like drawing? Why do you like art? Why do you like painting? Why do you like color? It's a release. It's um, Some people like to go out and fight. Some people like to go out and have conversation. I like to draw, paint, tattoo. You know, it's really amazing being a self-taught artist, but what would you say about the teaching here that you're getting the actual theory of art? The teaching here is absolutely awesome. It's almost a learn at your own pace factor. Like you have the teacher here whenever you do need that help or you do need information, the teacher's here to help you, absolutely. This mural is just one example of the artwork produced by the youth at the Urban Aboriginal School in Sault Ste. Marie. For Go Sault Ste. Marie, I'm Ann gordon -Aire. We are Urban Aboriginal School and we are watching Sean TV. <laughs> awesome. I love it. <laughs>